Hey, hey, hey. This is Kurt the Boat Doctor. This here is a beautiful 2018 190C runner. Uh, they're very nice. They got a nice wide uh, beam to them, wide bottom. Got like six and a half. So you got a little bit of reverse on the chine. Uh, does have the top, the sides, the backdrop. And on the tops, they have this nice zipper right here. So if you need to change bumpers when you're out in the water, large cleats, you can unzip it instead of unsnapping it and just pull your bumpers in. You got a diamond plate step, downrigger welded brackets, a large hole up front. The amount of water you would ever take up there anyway, it would come in, hit, blow out. By the time you look back out, there's going to be no water in that bow anyway. Uh, they kind of made them more streamlined, flattened out the gunnels on the sides a lot better. Put anchor guards on here, diamond plates, so when you pull the anchor, it doesn't scuff up your boat. And as you can see, that window's got that flap where you, you leave the snap to the window, and then you can just zip it and snap it. And then you got dual wipers, window stop, you got uh, spare tire carrier, Carlisle tires, or ST20575R14, five, five lug, uh, double dip galvanized modular triangular wheels. Uh, they even armor all them, they're Carlisle's. You got your two speed Fulton jack, <clears throat> which is nice to release that. You give it a little pressure, you put it back, you pull out on that handle, put it back over to the left, and then you do super slow mode. Got a safety chain tongue jack, swing tongue, put a lock on that. Just because some kid wants to pull that pin, you don't go with your boat running alongside you. You've got a top mount coupler, you got a two inch ball with a peek poo hole. Mm, peek a poo. Uh, standard flip, uh, you got your little uh, pin, safety pin that goes into your latch. Uh, brake fluid's up underneath here, it says remove cap. This has got to be pulled out to do that. If this is pushed in, you ain't gonna get that cap off. You're backing up if that wasn't plugged in. Your trailer wires, you can go to backup, you can back up. We do that with the heisters at work. Uh, wiring is a round seven that converts to a five for your truck. You got cables instead of chain. You got your safety chain for your brakes if it disconnects. It's gonna ignite your brakes, that's a keel roller. That keel roller, you don't want the boat riding on that, that's just to protect to running up there, but that keel's extra strength, they weld that on, so you got double thickness there. So that doesn't run on that cross member. All your identifications right down the trailers, the weight, the year, the serial numbers, the tire size, it's all down there. Uh, large cleats, downrigger pads, tandem axle. Uh, you got tandem chine guides, chine guide, it runs on this. Say your boats, uh, when you load it, it's important to get just the right amount of that trailer into the water. You get too much, the boat's gonna float and come over to here. Uh, if you don't get enough, you ain't gonna be able to power it up. So, but if you are out there, you notice this thing's here, turn the motor to the right, give it a little gas, and this boat will shoot on over, center it. You don't have to worry about a crooked boat when you pull out. Uh, gear bath oil hubs, you got slick bunks on there, you got two sets. These bunks go all the way out the back. You got a live well. You got a wards down pump. That's what those screens are for. There's your drain plug. You got a zinc bar. Uh, you got Sea Star hydraulic steering. You got the F 150s, a bulletproof motor, uh, 17 pitch prop, right hand. You got 11 by 7 on the 99. These are total salt water protected. You got internal zerks on each cylinder and on the main head, plus zinc right there, zinc it underneath. Same thing with the little motor. That's got two zincs on the, or three zincs internal. I think maybe only one actually on that one. And anyway, this pump is slow as grass. I want to get to 25 gallon and just barely pumping it. Uh, boat looks good. Top, sides, backdrop. And then I'll show you the inside when I'm doing this, but it's got the smooth right seats for dynamite. I'm going to bring my little buddy heater because there's ice on the windows. Don't get that heater really close to the windows. You can crack them. This is a live well. Your wash down, the dual battery, dual auto bilge pumps. You got a four mass rate of bilge pump or a live well down there. Uh, sleeper seat conversion, fuel gauge, and I'll show you that when I'm on the water. Boat Doctor out.